Hello, in this problem we're going to evaluate this definite integral. We have e to the 2x with respect to x, and we're going from 0 to the natural log of 6. So there's a couple ways to do this. You can make a u substitution, or you can use a formula, which is sometimes presented in certain books. I'm going to show you the formula, which you sometimes find in textbooks. The formula says if you have e to the bx with respect to x, and b is not zero, and you're trying to integrate this, it's actually super easy. It's simply e to the bx, then you divide by b, and you put a c here. That's your constant of integration. Since this is a definite integral, we don't need the c, but I wanted to include it in the formula for completeness. Okay, so in our example, the b is two. So this is actually just simply equal to e to the two x over two, just like that. You just divide by the two, and then you have the bracket here, and we're going from zero to the natural log of six. So zero ln six. So this is equal to, so the rule is you first plug in the top number and then you plug in the bottom number. So we get e to the two ln six over two minus, and then plugging in the zero, we get e to the two times zero over two, right? So again, putting the ln six where the x is gives us that minus and then putting the zero where the x is gives, gives us that. Very nice. So something interesting is going to happen here. Watch this. There's a rule that says if you have a number in front of a log, you can just bring it upstairs, okay? It's called the power rule for logs. So if you have p to the ln x, that's the same thing as ln x to the p. So basically you just bring it upstairs. You can do that with the two here. It'll be e to the ln six squared over two. Here we get e to the zero, which is one, so we just get one half. These cancel, so we get six squared over two minus one half. Six squared is 36 minus one half. 36 minus one is simply 35 over two. And that is the numerical value of this definite integral. Not a difficult problem, and hopefully you've learned something good. Good luck.